Thank you, Mr. President. I rise to talk today about a symbol of hatred in the United States. This symbol is commonly referred to as the Confederate battle flag. I have enrolled a bill today that would permanently ban this symbol of hatred from display or use on our uh, state capitol grounds. Article 1, Section 2 of the Michigan Constitution reads, quote, no person shall be denied equal protection of the laws, nor shall any person be denied the enjoyment of his civil or political rights or be discriminated against in the exercise thereof because of religion, race, color, or national origin. The legislature shall implement this section by appropriate legislation. History of the Confederate battle flag is often misinterpreted. The rebel flag, quote, as commonly referred to, is not true flag of the Confederacy. It was used sparingly during the Civil War when a tre treacherous government tried to overthrow our democracy. A democracy and a union that Michigan fought to preserve. In fact, at the beginning of the war, Michigan was asked to supply no more than one regiment of soldiers. Yet Governor Austin Blair, whose statue stands in front of our Capitol, sent seven instead. Then when Michigan was invited to the Washington Peace Accords by Virginia, our predecessors in this chamber passed a refusal resolution stating that, quote, concessions and compromise are not to be entertained or offered to traitors, end quote. The display or use of the Confederate battle flag destroys the history of our great state, and it destroys the history of this chamber. The flag serves no purpose to remember our history. In fact, it minimizes and contribute and contrib minimize the contributions of 15,000 Michiganders that gave their lives to preserve the Union and abolish slavery in the United States. Michigan should continue to be a place of equality and understanding. We owe it to our predecessors and our constituents to ban the display or use of the Confederate battle flag at our Capitol. I urge all of you to become co-sponsors of this bill and show our constituents that there is no place or no room for bigotry or hatred in Michigan. And I ask that my remarks be printed in the journal. Thank you.